Susan? You there? Sarah? Yes. Michael just came home. He's right here. Hey, Aiden, right? I got chased around by some vitals and had to take the long way around. Took me two damn days to work my way back home. I... You're okay? Not a scratch on me. I appreciate you looking out for me, man. I'm sorry I wasted your time. I swear he always does this. <laughs> Aiden, were you gonna say something? No. No, I'm glad it all worked out. Aiden out. No, wait, what the hell? I, I, I saw him die. Now he's home? All right, I had no idea this was Tolgan Fatin. I didn't even pay attention to the updates. But now we finally get to see them after... How long has it been? It's been a while. Last time I saw them, they ran into... A, what was that, a tunnel inside of a train or something? Years ago. And now we finally get to meet, meet them. Oh boy. All right, let's uh, meet him again. I had no idea they were here. All right, now let's try this again. What's going on, fellas? We are obviously dealing with an interdimensional breach scenario. These topological distortions are becoming increasingly frequent. Oh, Tolga, look at him. He won't know what that means. He's a simple soul in need of guidance. Explain it in his own language. Man, I miss him. Yes, of course, you're right. Now, Aiden, imagine you are in your happy place. A slightly urine-soaked cardboard box in some filthy alleyway, perhaps. To you, it seems like a mansion. Yes? You two must get punched a lot. Yep. Now, that box is your whole world. But outside of it, there are many other things. Multiverse. And one day, somebody punches a hole through the wall of your box. As the sunlight blinds you, you gibber in confusion because you have never seen it before. All you know is the box and its comforting smells. You cannot cope. And as you cower in fear, unable to deal with the implications of what is happening, new holes appear. To your primitive brain this is terrifying all right yeah i get it holes bad get to the point we need to investigate further that's why we've prepared these spectral goggles they will let you see the rifts as a bonus they will also obscure your features something the rest of us will appreciate beyond that all you need to do is use your core skill meaning you need to touch things. That's it? Just touch the anomalies? See? I told you he would be perfect for the job. So adaptive. Look, the last time I touched one of those things, I almost turned into a stain on a sidewalk. And yet, here you are, except without the data we need. Next time, you'll be better prepared. You're welcome. Now go stick your fingers into things until something interesting happens. <laughs> Get us my life. <laughs> data. Meanwhile, some of us have real work to do. All right. Ignore my comment. Let's uh, move on. Is this all I get? Goggles? Can I get a new weapon? Do I have to wear these? Are they at least good? Immunity, damage resistance, combat, park. Okay, well, not really that useful. That's kind of weird. Holy crap, this looks weird. Isn't this like the Night Runner, or not Night Runner, Night Hunter's vision? It's been a while since I've played. Okay, is there anyone that's close? Can I just look on the map? Nope. All right, let's uh, yeah. let's head towards the hospital. Yeah, this is the part where I. Either fast forward or skip to uh, getting there. Okay, that's fine. Okay, fellas, I'm at a rift. You sure this is safe? Define safe. Is it as safe as jumping off a rooftop? 
Is it as safe as facing an army of infected with a sharp stick? You'll probably be fine. Okay, I can't see if this is dangerous or not. Alright, this looks fine. I brought back crystals. Nice. Okay, what am I supposed to touch? Whoa, hey! What the? Come on, hit it! Holy crap! Okay, hold, 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 hold the phone. I just lost 10,000. Now nah, I'm getting everything. Yeah, and I'm shotgunning this guy. Alright, take two. Where are you at? Wait, what happened to my flashlight? Okay, this ain't doing it. Uh, what about this? Um, maybe this? Two thousand years later. Why is this taking so long? Am I not supposed to kill this thing? Alright, it looks like it's dying. I'm not sure of that. Alright, come on. There we go. Can I loot you? Alright, note to self, do not bother killing these things. It's a waste of time. I think I just wasted like half my durability on this on my weapon. Is that it? What was that? Wait, where am I? Uh, Aiden, uh, Fatin, he's back. Cancel Plan B. Oh, uh, good. Did you learn anything during your trip, Aiden? Things get weird out there. Very weird. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's just leave it at that. Alright. Well, that was, uh... Yeah, as he said, weird. But on to the next one. Alright, the next one. And this one's inside, isn't it? Alright, muscle... Generation and some ideas and have that ready. All right, where's the entrance? Oh, crap. Okay, bad idea, bad idea. Alright, let's take this th thing off for a second. I cannot see a thing. Wow, that is so much better. Alright, is there going to be a revenant that I have to avoid? Nope, it's water. Wait, isn't this where Aiden was before the first game? Like, the first part? Oh, what? Climb up! 
Okay, I'm gonna assume, uh, yeah. But I can't really tell. I mean, it looks like it. From the first game, well, for the first part of the game, sorry. Uh, where? Alright, first, let's see. Alright, there's nothing. Alright, moving forward. Sita, Mama, Baba, Baba. Back again, Aiden? If it is you. Of course it's me. Uh, say something only our Aiden would know. And what would that be? I know you guys are kind of dicks. Oh, a clumsy attempt at comedy. It's him. All right, that was uh. I'll be honest, I'm not a fan of this DLC, uh, if I'm being truly honest. I expected a little more than this. But you know, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll stay positive. Maybe this next one will uh, give us Kyle Crane or something. Uh, we'll see. I'm just really annoyed with this mask. Like, it just doesn't really do anything other than just show me where these giant blue lights are. <laughs> I'm guessing the stuff is already here. All right, let's see what you got for me. All right, we're loading in. I need to find a way to like... Why am I slow? special in these things maybe a nice weapon or... ah cigarettes perfect and this one lovely An owner's manual so incredible crazy DLC come on So far, nothing crazy. Ooh, wine. Tolga, Fatine, you there? Speak. These other realities, are they really real or just some kind of, I don't know, illusions? Of course they're real. Try to keep your confusion from hampering our progress. Tolga, you have to be gentle with him. You know he yearns for your approval. He's much like a puppy. All the literature says that rewarding correct behavior gets better results than punishment. I suppose you're right. What do you think he would find rewarding? A weapon. Should we make him a chew toy? You guys realize I can still hear you, right? Oh, Aiden. Our apologies. These radio frequencies can be so unpredictable. I doubt it. Alright, let's figure out where the next one is and hopefully fast travel right next to it. All right, the dam. Maybe it'll uh, give us a cutscene from the first game. You know, anything? Anything interesting at all? Like, the first one was just a revenant for nothing. Second one, I... Oh. I think I saw this in, like, a leaked scene or something. Do you have my paraglider? I don't have my paraglider. Yeah. Supposed to get in there? Where am I supposed to go? Let's 
Okay, I'm guessing this is the right way to go. Where's the door? Or I'll have to get to the other one. All right, not, not leaving me a lot of room. Okay, you know what? I have to take this off. I cannot see nothing. Okay, it's already still bright. And you made it. Okay, this is moving good. Alright. Try to make sure that there's any loot. All right, so so far not really much. This is pretty much where we go to for figuring out who Aiden is. That was close. All right, let's get the inhibitor. Aiden, this is Tolga. Come in. Go ahead, Tolga. When you travel through the rifts, what do you see? Please be precise. Right. Uh, flashes of light? Nothing specific. It's more what I feel. A wrenching sensation? And like, for an instant, somebody near me. You know, it's hard to explain, but it's a powerful feeling. The third man factor, perhaps. I'm sorry, what? It's a neurological thing. Your body and your brain are constantly talking. If those signals get scrambled, your brain can misinterpret your body's location slightly. So the sensation of another person there is, in fact, you sensing yourself. You're just not used to doing it from outside. That's a real thing? Yes. Or it could be a symptom of significant brain damage. But in your <laughs> case, how could we really tell? Yeah, All okay. right, I you think can we're die. Done here. All right, next one, and I think it was next to the Huntress, so we'll just fast travel. All right, here's the other one, right up here. Oh, I should have taken some boosters. Whoa. Why am I so tiny? Why is my sword so big? Okay, first let's uh, let's take a second to um, let's have a look around here. What is this? Can we even recognize it? I cannot get over how tiny I am. Wait, can I go in photo mode? <laughs> yep, that's a tiny Aiden right there. Not really much else to look at. Let's go. Alright, in we go. Or out we go, I should say. Or should it just be nighttime? Alright. What dialogue do we have now? Nothing? Oh, well, that's just disappointing. I swear, they're getting lazy with this update. Excuse me. And then I go. Like they could have at least given us. Some... Oh, what? The... All right, hold up. I need to actually see this. 
Did I kill this guy? the guy I was supposed to say. Oh, here we go. Cooler with the electricity. All right, do we get anything cool? Nope, just thrown out. Okay. Aiden, you can stop playing around with the rifts. We have all the data we can use. Are you sure? I think I'm kind of good at this. Oh, good. Everyone should experience something new once in their lives. Come back to the workshop. Yeah. We have a new plan. All right. Hopefully now something interesting and I don't have to wear those stupid goggles. Alright, what do you got for me now? We're back. Are we any closer to figuring this out? Of course, of course. We now know that these rifts are not just random occurrences. They're doorways, Aiden. Doorways that lead to other dimensions. So your little escapade was a jaunt along the edges of our reality. But it's not a pleasure cruise. Of course Unless not. we secure these doorways, there is a definite danger of our universe collapsing completely. I... well, okay. I'm... I'm just gonna assume you know what you're doing. How do we fix this? Why? We close the rifts and secure our reality. For that, we need some special technology. Fortunately, it turns out that we have already completed the design phase. We have drawn Lovely. up the plans, but this is where things get complicated. The plans are in a cave on the drafting table there. We know that cave, but we don't know uh, which cave it is precisely. Or which iteration of Tolga and Fatin drew up those plans. Wait, so, so there are different versions? By you, you mean other versions of you in other dimensions. It's complicated. Don't worry about it. I've seen something like that already. There was this guy, Michael. He was missing, and I was... Yes, yes. That cuts down on the need for explanations. You will need these gloves. They'll allow you to move through the rifts without... Well, without random space shifts. All right, now give me the part that's gonna suck. Well, uh, the cave, um, the target location is somewhat uncertain. It might require some zeroing in. Oh, he'll be fine. He'll get us our plans and stitch together the fabric of reality. Or we'll all die in uncomprehending agony as reality collapses around us. Just get us those plans. Let us do the thinking. No pressure, huh? Okay, I'll, I'm gonna be honest. I'm a bit bored of this. Like I was, I was expecting something interesting, like... I don't know, a volatile from the first game, or, you know, something. And instead, I'm wearing gear that's not even that good. Do I have to wear the mask as well? Like, this is taking down everything that I've worked for. Yeah, combat and parkour XP, and damage resistance. And I'm guessing I have to wear the mask as well. Oh, there's one... Where is that? Uh, Alright, I feel like it's somewhere around here, but, you know, I'll, just to be safe, I'll travel near there. Can I fast travel now? Alright. To here. Hopefully the cave is close. If not, I'm going to be real pissed. 